Hi everyone, this is Mika Mix Travels and I'm here to share with you my experience at Casita Isabel in Anilao, Batangas. So this trip has been memorable for all the wrong reasons. First, once you've reached the reception area, you'll notice that the furniture is not in good condition. It's too old. Second, the pools. Not dirty. Third, it was almost 5 p.m. when I was allowed to enter my room. Fourth, the reason for the delay or late check-in was because they said that they had to install a new heater. But during my three days stay at the hotel, there's no warm water or I could not feel that there's a heater. Fifth, the water flow in the shower was too weak. Sixth, my sliding door the one that has access to the small balcony could not be closed properly, so it means that it could not be locked. Seventh, when the manager told me that I still could not use the room because there's someone inside, I didn't feel that she was apologetic or not even accommodating. Hmm. Considering I was the only guest on the first day of my check-in, they didn't even think or consider to upgrade my room. You know, just to compensate and, you know, to show that they do care about their guests, about the welfare of their guests, right? Eighth, during my check-out, the lady at the reception asked me to double-check the billing statement before I pay. And so I did. And I noticed that they forgot to charge the entrance fee of my fur baby, which was like 500 per uh, per day. And so I was kind of happy at first because I thought they, they waived uh, Pucci's uh, fee. And so when I asked, she said, mm, sorry mom, I could not waive the fur baby's fee. And so I had to pay. 1000 for Pucci for the two three day two night stay at the resort if i only knew right guys and lastly i almost fell backwards like it was six feet deep i think when i accidentally slid going inside my car because again the place was not that well maintained <laughs>